Proverbs 30, you gotta help everybody. Because this is a hot topic in the church. You know? You let somebody, you let somebody get married, and man, it, it starts stirring stuff up. Amen, amen. Yep. Come on, it starts stirring stuff up. You know, it just does something. They tell me, I've seen this usually, and the, 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 the Saturday somebody gets married, a lot of people get sad that Saturday. Wow. And next Sunday, a lot of folk ain't come to church. Because oh. <laughs> they seem like again, people get passed over. Right. Oh, wow. Can you see that? <laughs> Some folk don't even go to, don't even go to, don't even go to wed. Because they're tired of seeing them and it's never theirs. I understand that. So we got to talk about this stuff. Because this is real, isn't it real? Because yeah. we're humans. Are we humans? Yes. Yeah. The humans, we got feelings, aspirations, and all that kind of stuff. So we need to understand this marriage situation. I wish I heard a, <coughs> a lesson along these lines when I was single. It'll help me a lot. I thank God my father pulled me aside and talked to me himself. But I guarantee there are a lot of other people who are around. They 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 start going through these mind trips because the devil start messing with your mind. When you start having issues with life. Amen. Let me give you the last reason. Proverbs 30, verse 25. The Bible says this. Listen to this. This is powerful. <coughs> the ants are people not strong. Yet they prepare their meat in the summer. Now you know what? A lot of us can learn from an ant. I call it ant sense. <laughs> Somebody say ant sense. Ant the sense. Bible says they, they prepare their, their meat in the summer. In other words, what they do, <coughs> an ant knows you better get cold. He'll take all his food. He'll hide it underground. Because he'll say, he said, man, when, it's, when the, when the uh, winter come, food is not going to be plentiful. So what is he doing? <coughs> He's preparing himself. Let me take another reason folks are not married. They're not prepared. Amen. Not prepared. Amen. If you marry the person <coughs> you're supposed to be married to but not, but not prepared, it's going to cause you problems. Big problems. Amen. Why would God connect you with somebody that you're not prepared to be connected to? Right. Right. And I will say this, there are some adjustments that you make <coughs> once you get married, but there are some basic things that must be included in every marriage. Some basics. And what I want to do today, I want to talk to men first, and then I'm going to talk to some women about preparation. 